guys and welcome back to another Origin Cats video. Now, I have a box here and huge shout out to my dad for getting this for me. You don't even know how excited I am for this. Um, yeah, huge shout out. I, wow. Um, anyway guys, I'm not going to tell you what it is. It's going to be a surprise. Uh, so let's just get right into it. Now guys, I am using a pocket knife. But uh, before you, uh, here's a little tip with knives. Never cut towards yourself. Um, that can be dangerous and it's just not a good idea. And I know I got a haircut that doesn't really look the best, but, so I do know, so you don't have to like say anything about it, but I am aware. Um, so as you saw by the title, uh, this is something Star Wars related. But I'm not gonna tell you what. bag it's from ebay so it's gonna be a little bit different than like an amazon package or something like that um so it's in a disney bag as you can see now some of you like, if you look at the side, if you're a big Star Wars or Disney fan, you probably already know what it is, because if you've, ever, if you've ever been to Disney World, you can probably tell by maybe, like, you have to look here, let me zoom in, so, okay. you might be able to tell what it is by the size and color, but if you can't, that's totally fine, let's open it. Okay, so now, by the tape, you can probably tell what it is, because they only have this tape for this one product. Oh my gosh. Okay, so as you can tell, uh, this is obviously a Sith lightsaber. You can tell by the symbol. Now, I think they only have one, but a uh, one Sith, but I could be wrong about that. As you can tell from the bottom, it's Darth Vader's lightsaber. Now, Darth Vader is actually my favorite character of all time. I like uh, Anakin, I like Obi-Wan, but Darth Vader is just how strong and powerful he is. It's not, he's not a good person, okay? But he's, he's really strong and really powerful, and he changed in Return of the Jedi. Um, you wanna know why it's actually called Return of the Jedi? It's because it's the return of Anakin. Not that's why it's called the Return of the Jedi, and not like I don't know celebration. Okay. Here, let me use the scissors since it's slightly like up and I don't want to scratch the case did you know 
some people throw away the case. Why would you want to do that? Oh my gosh. So you click this button in. Oh, there's more tape. Oh my gosh. Uh. Ooh, it's heavy. It's high quality. Feel it. So it has this like felt too. So, here. Okay, so, um, how do you turn it on? Anyway, obviously it's not a real lightsaber. A blade isn't gonna come out of nowhere. Now, if you're gonna purchase one of these for yourself, you have to purchase the blade separately unless the eBay seller is saying, hey, here's the blade, like, there, I'll get it on the table. Does it come in instructions? Here, wait, 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 it says something on the side. Oh, you have to take the cap out. I forgot about that. Okay. So, I have the blade. Um, if you're one of the older... Okay, we're gonna screw it in. Let me turn the lights off for this. Now, if you're one of the people who have been subscribed for a while, or if you went back and watched some of my old videos, I had a Galaxy's Edge lightsaber that I made. And um, so that's how I have the blade, but the official Shop Disney, this is where I do the official Shop Disney website has um, some stuff like some blades, so. Um, huh. Whoa. Okay, so on the camera. Whoa. On the camera, it looks pink, but obviously it's red. So, um, there you go. You have flash on clash. Uh, it's almost like a, almost a green color. Let me turn the lights back on for you guys. So it's like a green-ish color. Well, you know what, I forgot to do something, but. So as you can see, when you move it, like. <sighs> Depends on how you move it. I, I need more room. Um, give me one second, guys. So, audio is actually really good for it's weight, and I'll get into that in a little bit, but here. So it's got the moving effect sound, and I don't really have enough room to really show you any like tricks or anything, but here's what you do when you want to detach the blade. Side. 
and then you have the little plug and you just plop that back in. And you don't even have to do that. Yeah, you don't have to do that even. But it's got a little, you gotta line it up just right. Oops. You know what? So, here's, here, can I see the box? Thank you. Now, I believe, and you still have to take the little, like, stickers off, like, the little, like, to replace, you need to unscrew the bottom to, so, if you need to replace batteries, just unscrew this, um, simple enough. Anyway, I'll get that stuff off in a little bit, because I want to be really careful with it. Now, I believe this is based off the... Empire Strikes Back um, lightsaber because in every movie a lightsaber hill is always a little bit different so here so nothing happens like there's no sound or anything when you turn it on and you don't have a blade in it so you can have this for multiple things now the one thing that I don't suggest you doing with this lightsaber, unless you have a lot of money, dueling. Now, it, it's fun and all, but if you're looking forward to dueling, get the $5 ones at Target. I would not want to... I'm not saying this is fragile. They're actually really tough. But it's more... You don't want to go full force like in the movies. Now, I know that sounds like that sucks, but, you know. Another thing, which I am not going to do this. Uh, you can just have it for display. Like, you never really use it. You just have it for display. Which, I understand why some people would do it. But, $200 lightsaber. Well, if you get this, if you get this from eBay, it's most likely $200. But if you go to actual... Disney World, it's 150 but, like, a Disney World ticket for one day is $100, not including the traveling, so, you know. If you're just wanting a lightsaber and not a vacation, just get it off eBay. Um, let me get the tape off on the other side, because I don't like that. Anyway. Um, I'm getting off track. So, dueling, don't do. Display, you can do, but I'm not going to do that because that's kind of just like, not necessarily wasting the lightsaber, but it's not really, I don't know, you know what I'm talking about. Like, I'd much rather have it on display than duel with it because I don't want to get it broken. Or, like, tough duel, but, like, play duel, yeah, you can do. Um, but, so now it's much easier to open. So, you can have it for display or tricks. Now, the most intense tricks I would do with this is, bless you. Thank you. Is the, um, Obi Annie, if you guys know what that is, um, it's in Revenge of the Sith, where it was that one, like, two-second scene, but it's a big thing, and um, there's tons of YouTube tutorials. I'm actually trying to learn it. That's the most intense trick that I would do, but you could always do some, and if you're well-trained, then yeah, you can do, like, about anything with this, but if you're somewhat, uh, I just, the most intense I'd do is the Obi Annie. And you might be thinking, well, then how am I going to practice? Well, if you're going to do dueling, you might have a $5 saber from Target. So, yeah. Another thing that you could do, it, it would be extremely expensive. But if you really wanted a Halloween costume that looked good and looked realistic. Okay, I'm not doing that. Then I... It would be a lot of money. 
I won't lie, but I think this would be. See, every time it does that, it sounds like it's supposed to break, but it doesn't break. I don't know. Yeah, it would be really cool with a Halloween costume. Another thing that it has, and like I said, this was supposed to be a Disney thing only, but of course, people on eBay are going to um, resell it. Uh, so at Disney, you can buy a belt clip, and I actually have one, but I forgot to bring it. This little part, it will just stay on your belt, and yeah, I mean, it looks cool. You could get that. It'd look nice. So, basically, you could do anything with this except for really intense dueling. Um, or, like, if you're not so sure about lightsaber tricks. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Huge. Hey. Okay, so my dad actually made a good point. Um, so, I'll take this. Sorry about this, guys. This is a Chia pet, and I'm not gonna spoil his name because this is a video that I think a lot of people could learn from if they wanted to purchase this. So, yeah, I'm not gonna spoil his name. So we got Baby Yoda, a Chia pet. And basically what a Chia pet is, you have these little like seed things, um, and you put it all over the so you put the seed things all over the pod and it grows and i'm not really sure if you water it. i don't know i've never really had a chia pet i know a little bit about it um but you got a little baby odo right there and another one right there um so yeah, I will do. I will definitely do a video on this when it's all planted and done. I'm probably gonna do that in the spring, um, so it can grow the best. Anyway, guys, huge, huge, huge shout out to my dad for getting me this and this. But this, um, we got a while back, so I'm not sure if you can still get it. I bet you can, but I'm not 100% sure. Um, but huge shout out to my dad. Let me show you guys the light one more time because the lightsaber with the blade because I don't think I did that enough. I know I keep saying with the light. All right. All right. So proof that it's red. Um. You could just believe me, or... As you can see, it's more of a red glow on my actual face. There. It's red. I don't know why, but it makes it look pink. Um, it'd be weird if Darth Vader had a pink lightsaber, but I'm glad he doesn't. So... <laughs> And then here, that's the best, I, the, that's the closest I can get to the speaker with the flash on the flash. Um, anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you don't mind, can you please give this a like, uh, or even consider subscribing. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed, and I hope this helped. Bye.